the American people for the extraordinary honor of being elected your 47th president and your 45th president. Look at that. Guys, it's time to go to bed. <laughs> None of us are stressed about the election, right? <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I'm done with you. I'm done with you and your mother and your sister. I'm just done with. Oh no! Why? 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 When did it end? Young man, there's no need to feel. Senate race. It's not gonna happen. Go, go. We'll be returning to the Senate. <laughs> Down, oh, we don't want to freak out because it's not even real. Because, bitch, count the vote. I just voted and I chose family. I chose women. I chose America. I love you. I It's an utter betrayal for any pain that is not a cisgendered white People who are not a part of anybody's elite who are hurting tonight. Um, uh, there are African American women who know a little bit about being talked down to and know a little bit about having their economic dreams crushed, who tried to dream a big dream over the past couple of months. And tonight they're trading in a lot of hope for a lot of hurt. And they were hoping that maybe this time, this time, one of their own could be seen as worthy. Here we go again. Can you imagine what they must think of it? These people are crazy. Listen, regardless of who you're voting for, there's no way you could sit there, sit on a tripod, put your phone up, and reenact a cry on damn social media. At the end of the day, have your reaction in peace with your family. What happened to that? What happened to that? Nobody's trying to see you guys cry and uproar and go crazy because Donald Trump won. Rather, whether Donald Trump won, whether Kamala Harris won, there's no way you should be reacting like that. I think those reactions alone will have some people switch from Kamala to Trump. Be like, yeah, bro, if these are the people that are supporting Kamala, I don't even want to be there. It's the facts. I don't even want to be there. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, you'd rather just be where, with the Trumps and, and, and move on from there. For me, I have no dog in the race. I am a Canadian and we are stuck with Mr. Trudeau and I'm pretty sure our lives are harder than than yours at this point because Trudeau for the love of God the man turned the man turned Canada into New Delhi it's pretty bad I'm not gonna lie to you it's Bollywood time and if you're from Toronto or any of those areas you already know these guys are chaos but anyways nobody's trying to see those videos so let's stop nobody's trying to see you cry nobody's trying to see any of that you guys look ridiculous.